Jogo, exceptional player, exceptional boy. Um, was for us two years ago. Two years ago? One and a half? I don't know. Maybe two times. One and a half years ago. Huh? Yeah. So perfect signing because um, he has everything what uh, a Liverpool player in this squad needs. He has, uh, he has the technical skills, he has um, the physical skills, and he's very smart and can learn all the tactical stuff pretty quick. On top of that, he can play all three positions. If you put me in a 4 2 three, one, we could play him the 10. Um, so it's very helpful, has the speed, has the desire uh, to finish situations off and um, really good. So he's saying his goal scoring record is pretty impressive if I'm right. Unfortunately, he had um, a big injury um, last year um, and that is um, never helpful. Uh, but he's back, thank God. Um, and um, yeah, fits really well in this team and I'm really happy for him. Actually, today I thought they could have made a slightly better decision before he then scored. Maybe he was smart enough um, to wait for the next ball that he can finish it um, off easier. But um, I thought we should have scored with the situation before already. But all good. And Diogo um, is a good player. I, told, I, I think it's it's not so easy to talk about football games when you lose them like we did last year too often in a specific period of the season. But I... I uh, I knew what we are lacking. We, we, we were lacking stability. We didn't have stability, not because we had no center half for a while and had to find solutions for that. The problem was that we were like in an early stage, we were like shocked that we that we cannot play the football anymore we wanted to play because we didn't have the, the stability and uh, and uh, which we have now, obviously, with the uh, that everybody knows exactly what he has to do. When you put the midfielders back in the last line, then you put midfielders in the line who usually don't play there or are protected by either Hendo or Fab. And now they play double six and these kind of things. So that's a problem. And all of a sudden you lose you lose your rhythm. And um, that's what happened to us last year. We had to find a solution. Thank God we found the solution early enough to qualify for the Champions League. Um, and this year we had a preseason, which was a proper preseason, which was incredibly helpful. And especially um, up front, um, with Sadio and Mo, they had a, the longest preseason. I'm pretty sure they had for ages. Um, and that was helpful. Um, so we could really work on a lot of things and um, found the stability back. Talking about stability, I was not happy with the chances we conceded today, to be honest. Um, because the, I have no problem that Ali um, has to make saves in a football game, but these saves were too spectacular. Um, the one one against a goalie should not happen twice in a game for sure not. Um, so uh, we have to really um, work on that. We have to to be as stable, serious, ruthless defensively as somehow possible. That gives us then. Uh, the platform to to play football and then we can create and then we can score. It will not be forever like this that we score two goals per game, but it happened so far and um, so good. But if we win a game 1-0, I'm happy as well. <laughs>